Happy New Year. It's 2021 and hopefully by the time that you're watching this video you've got over your hangover. If not, that's a pretty epic party you've had. In this video I'm going to use a Withing Sleep Analyzer to trigger an IFT Pro applet. That IFT Pro applet is basically going to allow me to have a little midday nap, set up the room so I'm ready to have my nap, wake up afresh in an hour or so and then get back on with work. And don't forget, for your chance to win both the Withing Sleep Analyzer featured in this video, plus not one, but two one-year subscriptions to IFT Pro, make sure you stay tuned right the way until the end of the video, where I'll be giving you instructions on how you can win those prizes. We start this IFT applet with the Withing Sleep Analyzer as the trigger. So if this, I'm going to click on Add, type Withings. Here you can see the Withing Sleep, so that's the service that works with the Withing Sleep Analyzer. And so I'm going to say when I get into bed. So I want this to fire every time that I get into bed. Now it turns out uh, you can actually set when this should fire and when it shouldn't fire. Uh, oddly enough, it says, you know, for example, your cat can't accidentally trigger a response. Uh, we have no cat, uh, so I'm going to go for basically this triggering setting to none, so any time of day. Because as we say, we want this to trigger if I get into bed um, during the day. So which sleep sensor to use? I've only got the one, so that's the Withing sleep sensor that I've set up. And that's your trigger. The next thing we're going to do is just go and add uh, sunset or rather the weather. So if I do underground, uh, weather, sorry, weather underground. And as we've done before in some of the other applets, you're going to select current weather. I'm going to put in the address. So we're going to go for Reading, UK. And add that query. As we know, I'm going to go and put in the filter code after I've gone and created the um, actions that it's going to go and uh, uh, go and perform uh, if this trigger is true. So the, then that, basically what I want to do is three things. So the first is I want to close the blinds. So I have a Somfy to Homer bridge. And from here, I'm going to launch a scenario I've already created. And surprisingly enough, it's called Close Loft Blinds. And that goes and closes all the loft blinds for me. The next thing we want to do is actually turn off the lights. So we've got a hue. And I want to turn off the lights. And again, it's the ones in the bedroom that I want to turn off. So we're going to select Bedroom. Create that action. And then last of all, it's quite a natty little service that I found. And so actually, if you want to perform something on Alexa, it's been quite hard to, to do that. But it turns out there's a service that connects between uh, IFT and uh, Alexa to be able to trigger Alexa routines. So I've already sent this up. The one to look up is Alexa Actions by MK Zents. Really, really cool little tool, so well worth having a look at. And so I've already set up a routine that if trigger action, if trigger uh, two is run, then it'll speak through the speakers, and it's going to say enjoy your nap. So I'm going to select if trigger two. So just to kind of confirm, that's basically going to run a routine that's connected to if trigger two within uh, the Alexa routines, and that simply just says enjoy your nap. On a particular speaker and in the Alexa um, settings I've said that speaker should be the one in the bedroom so they're all, they're all the actions that I want to go do now I need to put in some filter code so I clicked on the plus there and then I go to add filter so here's one I kind of made earlier basically 
And so what this does is actually it takes the current time uh, and passes that with uh, the uh, sunset. And so basically, if the current time is bigger than sunset for the particular day, i.e. it's after sunset, then basically skip all of these actions. However, if it's during the day, which is what we want to trigger here, then go do those actions. Create that filter, click on continue, enjoy my nap, click on finish, and we're done. Let's go and see if it works. Time for a midday nap. Enjoy your nap. So now for the exciting bit, the competition. So there's three things I need you to do in order to be entered into the competition. The first is to subscribe to the channel so you'll see more videos as they come out. The second is to like this video. And then the third is to put in the comments how you would use the Withing Sleep Analyzer with an IFT Pro applet. The best one will get a one year subscription to IFT Pro and the Withing Sleep Analyzer. And the second best one that you come up with will still get a one year subscription to IFT Pro. Terms and conditions are gonna be in the description and I'll pick a winner two weeks after this video is published. Good luck.